Hey everybody, it's Christmas and it's Tom Antheon live. This is the dumb holiday joke edition. <laughs> I, I hope, uh, those of you that haven't had too much eggnog today can stop by and uh, <laughs> say hello. And all we're going to do is tell dumb jokes today. Uh, might have one announcement for you later. Make sure you comment, say hello. Oh, there's Coach uh, Carol. Hey, Coach, how are you, man? I want for Christmas to be able to serve like you. <laughs> and um, hey, there's Oren. Merry Christmas, Oren. Good to see you here. Make sure you put comments, put your websites in. Well, uh, those of you out there that have had too much eggnog, uh, your jokes will probably be better than mine. <laughs> we, uh, so uh, it's like 90 degrees here today in Virginia Beach. Doesn't feel like Christmas at all. But uh, we're going to tell a lot of dumb jokes today. Bring, hope you brought yours uh, with you. <laughs> uh, let's, I'm going to get mine out here. The entire thing is going to be dumb holiday jokes today. And uh, let me get mine out here. And you're uh, besomeone.org for Oring. Yay, good. Yeah, this is a great organization that's helped a lot of kids. I'll tell you, keep them off the street. Um, so, yeah, if you have your dumb holiday joke, feel free to throw it in there. Uh, and we will... Uh, <laughs> we will read it out loud unless I've got it duplicated on here somehow. So, uh, all right, well, let's get going here now. Uh, this is actually going to be uh, uh, a show your kids can listen to because uh, there's only a few risque jokes in here and they're probably too young to understand them anyway. So don't worry about it. So so here we go. Let's get going here. <laughs> this is just dumb holiday jokes. And uh, like I said, if you have some, throw them in the chat box and we'll uh, read them out loud. So, what do you call an elf who sings? You got to think about this one. A rapper. W-R-A-P-P-E-R. <laughs> Stupid, right? Why is Christmas just like your job? You do all the work and the fat guy with the suit gets all the credit. <laughs> uh, let's see. Why is Santa so jolly? Because he knows where all the naughty girls live. Uh, let's see. Hey, Alan, how are you? Hey, Alan, Cosette can even listen to this uh, this version of the show if she's around. Um, there'll just be a few risque uh, Santa jokes, but uh, nothing nothing too bad. Let's see. Um, well, here's one of them. <laughs> Why doesn't Santa have any kids? <laughs> he only comes once a year, and that's down the chimney. <laughs> uh, what's the difference between a Christmas alphabet and the ordinary alphabet? The Christmas alphabet has no L. <laughs> uh, what do you call people who are afraid of Santa Claus? Claustrophobic. <laughs> Why? Uh, Why can't the Christmas tree stand up? Well, it doesn't have any legs. Why not? What do you call an obnoxious reindeer? Rude off. <laughs> Why was Santa's little helper depressed? Because he had low elf esteem. <laughs> what do you call a can wearing a Christmas hat? A merry can. <laughs> What's the difference between snowmen and snow ladies? Well, of course, we know snowballs. <laughs> Uh, okay, so I only got one announcement today, and that's it. Hey, Vanessa, how are you? Uh, and that is my year-end sale, which I didn't have last year. <laughs> All right, my year-end sale was uh, is on the 28th, usually every year, and just enormous discounts, and this is the only time ever I'm uh, discounting the entry fee to my mentor program, 25% off. You missed 35% off if you're in the Screw the Commute thing uh, last week, so that cost you some bucks. But uh, be ready for deep discounts on all kinds of great training and stuff on Wednesday is the 28th at 10 a.m. Eastern is when we re 
release it. Okay, so if you have a dumb Christmas joke, uh, throw it in there in the box and we'll read it out loud. All right, what nationality is Santa Claus? <laughs> North Polish. <laughs> what do you call a kid who doesn't believe in Santa? A rebel without a clause. <laughs> Uh, let's see. Uh, hey, everybody that's checking in uh, now, uh, say hello. And if you have any dumb Christmas jokes, throw them in there. <laughs> uh, let's see. Uh, what do you call Santa's helpers? <laughs> this is for you really bright people out there. Subordinate clauses. <laughs> uh, let's see. Uh, the four stages of life. One, you believe in Santa Claus. Two, you don't believe in Santa Claus. Three, you dress up as Santa Claus. And four, you look like Santa Claus. <laughs> hey, a song told me to deck the halls. Well, Mr. and Mrs. Hall are not very happy. <laughs> All right, remember, put your dumb Christmas jokes in there. Don't let me be alone out here with 90 more. <laughs> I think I got 97 dumb Christmas jokes. Uh -oh. Okay, here's Alan Bree says, if a reindeer lost its tail, where could he get a new one? I don't know. Where could he, Alan? Put it in there. If a reindeer lost its tail, where could he get a new one? At a retail store. <laughs> Perfect. You have the spirit of Christmas. <laughs> very dumb joke. We love it. <laughs> that was a very good one. <laughs> Okay, let's see. This holiday season, in lieu of gifts, I decided to give everyone my opinion. <laughs> Why does Santa have three gardens? So he can ho, ho, ho. Uh, what kind of motorbike does Santa ride? A Holly Davidson. <laughs> what do you call a cat in the desert? Sandy Claus. What do you call a dog who works for Santa? Santa Paws. Let's see. What do you get if you cross Santa with a detective? Santa Clues. <laughs> what did the C say to Santa? Nothing. It just waved. <laughs> what do you get if you cross Santa with a duck? A Christmas quacker. <laughs> Alan again. <clears throat> what is the best Christmas present in the world? I don't know. What is it? <laughs> I don't know. There's a delay here. What is the grass? A broken drum. You can't beat it. <laughs> there you go. All right. Let's see. Who delivers presents to baby sharks at Christmas? Santa Jaws. <laughs> what says O O O? Santa walking backwards. <laughs> what goes ho, ho, whoosh, ho, ho, whoosh? Santa going through a revolving door. <laughs> uh, let's see. Um, what is Santa's favorite place to deliver presents? Idaho, ho, ho. <laughs> Who is Santa's favorite singer? Elphis Presley. <laughs> what do Santa's little helpers learn at school? The elf a bet. Let's see. Why did uh, what did Santa say to a smoker? Please don't smoke around me. It's bad for my elf. <laughs> what does Santa? Uh, where does Santa go when he's sick? To an elf center. Uh, where do elves go to dance? Christmas balls. Hey, <laughs> Lynn Macbeth. <laughs> Hey, sweetheart. How you doing there, kiddo? That's my old home girl. Uh, what to, this is our dumb, by the way, this is our dumb uh, holiday joke edition, Lynn. What do elves eat for breakfast? And I don't even get this one. Frosted flakes. Uh, what do you call a frozen elf hanging from the ceiling? An elf sickle. <laughs> Hey, don't forget to put your dumb jokes in there, and we'll read them out loud. Uh, let's see. Who is the king of Santa's rock and roll helpers? Of course, it's Elphus. <laughs> Lynn is okay, I'm listening. Uh, how's the weather up there, Lynn? I'm, I'm out of that snow crap. I hate that. 
Uh, let's see. What do you get if Santa goes down the chimney when a fire is lit? Crispy Kringle. <laughs> what type of shoes does Santa wear when he travels on a train? <laughs> Platforms. <laughs> Why do reindeer hang on their Christmas tree? What do re reindeer hang on their Christmas tree? Oh, good. 62 degrees. Oh, that's not bad. What do reindeer hang on their Christmas trees? Horn a month. <laughs> Why are Christmas trees so bad at sewing? They always drop their needles. Oh, and that's cute. Did Rudolph go to school? <laughs> no, he was elf taught. <laughs> what do you call Rudolph with lots of snow in his ears? Anything you want. He can't hear you. <laughs> Hey, Liz, how are you? Put your dumb Christmas joke in there. Don't leave me hanging out here. What did Santa ask Rudolph about the weather? Is it going to rain, dear? <laughs> what happened to the turkey at Christmas? It got gobbled. Uh, what do you get when you cross a snowman with a vampire? Frostbite. <laughs> I look adorable, do I? Or I just look ridiculous, like always. Uh, let's see. Um, what song do you sing at a snowman's birthday party? Freeze a jolly good fellow. <laughs> what did Adam say on the day before Christmas? It's Christmas, Eve. <laughs> what, uh, what carol is heard in the desert? O camel, ye faithful. <laughs> uh, let's see, we're only ha we're halfway, folks. <laughs> only halfway. Hey, somebody's got to come up with some other ones out there. Ask your kids for help if you don't know any. Let's see. What do angry mice send to each other at Christmas? Cross mouse cards. <laughs> What's the best Christmas present? Oh, <laughs> Alan had that one right. How do sheep in Mexico say Merry Christmas? Fleece Navidad. <laughs> okay, here's Alan again. What's a good holiday tip? Okay, John says, how do you know a snowman doesn't like you? <laughs> he gives you the cold shoulder. <laughs> uh, let's see. Alan says, what's a good holiday tip? Never catch snowflakes with your tongue until all the birds have gone south. <laughs> That is a great tip. <laughs> oh, man. Let's see. Um, how did Scrooge win the football game? The ghost of Christmas passed. <laughs> uh, what's green covered in tinsel and goes ribbit, ribbit? A missile toad. <laughs> uh, let's see. Uh, let's see. Oh, what's the most popular Christmas wine? I don't like Brussels sprouts. <laughs> Get it? Wine? Why? Uh, let's see. Uh, why? What did the beaver say to the Christmas tree? Nice gnawing you. <laughs> what do you get if you cross a Christmas tree with an apple? A pine apple. <laughs> what's the best thing to put into a Christmas cake? Your teeth. What do you call a bunch of chess players? Oh, this is a good one. What do you call a bunch of chess players? Orin, you ought to get this one. Bragging about their games in a hotel lobby. This is a very cerebral one here. What do you call a bunch of chess players bragging about their games in a hotel lobby? <laughs> Chestnuts boasting in an open foyer. <laughs> That was really good. Okay, let's see. All right, here's some uh, uh, different kind. Where do snowmen keep their money? I don't know. In a snowbank. <laughs> did, you, did you know Santa had only eight reindeer last Christmas? No, why? Comet stayed home to clean the sink. <laughs> uh, let's see. What does snowman like to do on the weekend? I don't know. What? Chill out. <laughs> what else? What does Jack Frost like best about school? I don't know. Snow and tell. <laughs> what are you going to give your little brother for Christmas this year? I haven't decided yet. What do you give him last year? 
the measles. <laughs> what has a jolly laugh, brings you presents, and scratches up your furniture? Santa Claus, C-L-A-W-S. <laughs> what do elves do after school? I don't know, what? Their gnome work. <laughs> What's the difference between Santa's reindeer and a knight? K-N-I-G-H-T. One slays the dragon and the other dragon the slay. <laughs> when asked about his job, Frosty always replies, there's no business like snow business. Let's see. We're three quarters of the way done, folks. Let's see. Knock, knock. Who's there? Dexter. Dexter who? Dexter Halls with Bowser. Of... <laughs> what did one snowman say to the other snowman? What? Do you smell carrots? <laughs> that was a good one. Uh, let's see. Uh, what did the reindeer say to the football player? I don't know. Your blitzing days are over. One day, a little boy... Oh, now we're getting a little, a little shaky here. One day, a little boy wrote to Santa Claus, Please send me a sister. This is, the one, this is like the ones I would use in my naughty Santa days when I used to do Santa Claus. A little boy wrote to Santa, Please send me a sister. Santa Claus wrote back, Okay, send me your mother. <laughs> I wasn't planning on giving Christmas gifts this year until I heard about those exploding Samsung Galaxy phones. <laughs> oh, here we go again. A little naughty. If your, le if your left leg was Thanksgiving and your right leg was Christmas, uh, <laughs> oh, can I, if your left leg was Thanksgiving and your right leg is Christmas, can I come visit you between the holidays? <laughs> that was a good one. I gotta remember that one. Uh, if you jingle my bells, I promise you a white Christmas. <laughs> uh, let's see. Uh, remember, kids, the best way to get a puppy for Christmas is to beg for a baby brother. <laughs> Are you Christmas? Because I want to marry you. What's the difference between Tiger Woods and Santa? What's the difference between Tiger Woods and Santa? <laughs> Santa stopped at three hoes. <laughs> Sorry, Tiger. <laughs> Who is never hungry at Christmas? The turkey is always stuffed. Let's see. Did you hear about the dis... <laughs> you got to think about this one. Did you hear about the dyslexic Satanist? He sold his soul to Santa. <laughs> you got to think about that one. Let's see. Uh, oh, you are the reason even uh, Santa... Uh, you're the reason Santa has a naughty list. <laughs> there are 364 days until Christmas and people already have their lights up. <laughs> think about that one. Let's see, uh, oh, here's a Santa pickup line. <laughs> Want to meet Santa's little helper? Uh -huh. should say big helper. I remember as a child, <laughs> this is a really sick one. I remember as a child lying in bed waiting for Santa to come. Then there was always that awkward silence <laughs> as he got up, dr got dressed and left. <laughs> <laughs> that has to be the worst, one of the worst ones I've ever said in my life. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, I am the ghost of Christmas, future perfect subjunctive. <laughs> Good for you, you English majors out there. I am the ghost of Christmas, future perfect subjunctive. I will show you what would have happened were you not to have changed your ways. <laughs> How do you know that Santa is a man? Well, no woman wears the same outfit every year. My wife set a limit on how much we can spend on each other for Christmas. It's a hundred for me and five hundred for her. What do you uh, What do you say? Oh, what do you say, baby? We make this not a not so silent night. Uh, screw the nice list. I've got you on my nice and naughty list. What did Santa say when he got diagnosed with VD? <laughs> oh, oh no! <laughs> Oh, you ho! <laughs> uh, that's not a candy cane in my pocket, honey. I'm just glad to see you. <laughs> oh, Jeff, you're almost... You're perfect timing, Jeff. You have to watch the rerun. 
throw in a, a dumb Santa joke if you have time, because we're almost done. Uh, let's see. Is your name Jingle Bells? Because you look like you can go all the way. Uh, let's see. How about I slip down your chimney at half past midnight? <laughs> These are all dirty Santa jokes I used when I played Naughty Santa. Uh, let's see. You know I would love to show you the toys my elves make for adults. Uh, let's see. How do you scare a snowman? You get a hair dryer out. <laughs> Interested in seeing the North Pole, honey? Well, at least that's what Mrs. Claus calls it. And last, and definitely the least, another Santa pickup line. Hey, cutie, did you ever do it in a sleigh? <laughs> so, Merry Christmas, everybody. I just want to do something goofy and fun tonight. Not real heavy. No cussing, no nothing. Uh, and uh, I want to wish everybody a very Merry Christmas. Happy Holidays if you don't celebrate Christmas. And... Uh, and just one last message for you to, you know, I'm an animal lover, animal freak. You know, I think it's time that you adopt another animal. Uh, <laughs> it's Christmas Eve. Yeah, what did Adam <laughs> the day before Christmas? We did that one, all right, Jeff? You're too late. Um, don't you think you could use an animal in your life or another one if you already have one? They're just such loving souls and they really can change your whole life around. Yeah, it takes a little bit of upkeep and taking care of them, but boy, do they give the love. And what a what a great season to think about going down to the shelter. And and uh, oh, the, the hardest thing will be to pick one and leave the rest. I mean, so take some friends with you. Have an adoption uh, party or something. Just, uh, uh, you know, that's kind of my calling is to, to help the, the little uh, helpless souls that can't help themselves and they're just full of love. Uh, even the ones that are abused a lot of times will just love you. You know, they they they, they were put on earth for that. You know, a, a dog spelled backwards, you know, is God and all that. So, um, yeah, if you can find it in your heart and home, uh, please go down and uh, uh, to the shelter and, uh, and put, you know, guess what? You know, you rescue them, a lot of people out there. Um, hey, Luz adopted a kitty. Hey, Luz. Uh, you know, a lot of people say that, uh, you know, they went down to rescue a pet. And because of things that are going on in their life, the pet rescued them. All right. So, um, please, if you can. Uh, Jeff says, I have three. More when I get more property. Rescue dogs are the most loyal. Yeah, for sure. Um, Rebecca, nice for you to stop by just as we're leaving. <laughs> but uh, Merry Christmas to you, too. Make sure you watch the replay if you want some... Dumb laughs that are pretty much uh, PG rated for once. Uh, and uh, anyway, uh, Merry Christmas to everybody. I know you got uh, family obligations and things to do, but uh, just wanted to uh, say hello, have a few laughs with you, and make my uh, my pledge for the animals. So, so anyway, Merry Christmas, everybody. I'll see you next Sunday. I think is what New Year's, right? So I might uh, I might take you to Times Square next week. All right, see you later. Merry Christmas, Al.